You may keep your secrets from your friends, from your parents, your children, your doctor, even your personal trainer. But it takes real effort to conceal your thoughts. From Google, smart cities will pullulate with sensors all joined together by the Internet of Things. Bollards communing invisibly with lampposts, so there is always a parking space for your electric car, and the urban environment is as antiseptic as a Zurich pharmacy. A future Alexa will pretend to take orders, but this Alexa will be watching you, clucking her tongue and stamping her foot. Your mattress will monitor your nightmares, your fridge will beep for more cheese, your front door will sweep wide the moment you approach like some silent butler. Are we doomed to a cold and heartless future in which computer says yes or computer says no with the grim finality of an emperor in the arena? AI, what will it mean? Helpful robots washing and caring for an aging population or pink-eyed terminators sent back from the future to cull the human race? What will synthetic biology stand for? Restoring our livers and our eyes with miracle regeneration of the tissues like some fantastic hangover cure? Or will it bring terrifying limbless chickens to our tables? Will nanotechnology help us to beat disease or will it leave, leave tiny robots to replicate in the crevices of our souls? It is a, a trope as old as literature that any scientific advance is punished by the gods. When Prometheus brought fire to mankind in a tube of fennel, as you may remember, with his brother Epimetheus, Zeus punished him by chaining him to a Tartarian crag while his liver was pecked out. I talked about a hangover cure. His liver was pecked out by an eagle, an eagle and every time his liver regrew, the eagle came back and pecked it again. And this went on forever. A bit like the experience of Brexit in the UK. 